Yo, yo, mic check one, two, one, two, mic check one, two, one, two. <clears throat> perfect, perfect. We are live. How y'all doing today, man? I hope everybody's having an amazing day. We gon' goddamn get this joint popping. Yes, sir. Welcome back to Four Cloud Channel. I am Yuri Santana. We about to jump back in the Persona Five Royale. Get this joint popping all the way, man. We going all the way up with this one. All the way up. All right. So, tell you where we left off. We didn't put in 48 hours on this game. Mm. All right, be cautious of med jet. I can do all kinds of housework, you know. If you have time, request me by phone. Okay, I'm still at work. I'll talk to you later. Kawakami's working today. Use the yellow phone if you want to call her. Decide later. Hey, good evening. I'm in Kichi Joji right now. If you got some time, want to drop by for a bit? What's the plan? Are you going to see a Kichi? And... Let me see, man. Uh, should I chill out with? Forgot her name. Kawakami. Yeah, I'm gonna chill with her. I ain't fucking with dude. Let's make the call then. Are you gonna call Kawakami? Mm, yeah, sure. Hi, this is Becky. Uh, wait, it's you. It's summer, but don't lose focus. You're still in high school, so don't go out playing at night. Wait, is this considered playing at night or worse? Well, it's under my supervision. It's fine. She looks so bad at night. Oh, my God. As long as you request me, I'll do your housework for just 5,000 yen. Yeah, we can afford it. We can afford it. We can afford it. I don't condone and tricking, y'all. But we can afford it. We can afford it. We, we, we can afford it. <laughs> I don't think my bond with Kawakami will deepen just yet. It'll cost you 5,000 yen, but are you going to call Kawakami over? Check bond with Kawakami. She claimed to be struggling with money due to her little sister's medical expenses. Slack off. Next ability is housekeeping. I didn't know you could check all this. Your homeroom teacher at Shujin Academy. She offers help if you keep quiet about her job as a maid. It allows you to request Kawakami to brew coffee or do laundry for you. Yeah, call her over, bro. I ain't know she was clutch like that. Hey, I'll get dropped off from the store then. Please clean up your room and wait for me. You're a maid. Clean up my room. Hey, 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 hey. Kawakami clean my room. She seems to be thankful that I requested her. Maybe there's a way to make sure Kawakami has a good time. Oh, that's right. I have something Kawakami might like. Considering Kawakami, I feel she'd be happy to receive something that would improve her life. Mm. So this is the latest model. Wow, they're able to make things so much smaller these days. This is a really nice present, thank you. Yeah! It feels like.
like I really captured Kawakami's heart. I feel like my bond with Kawakami will grow soon. Thank you for your patronage. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Seems you've got your share of problems, inmate. I think you would relax under such circumstances. Either you're quite bold or quite foolish. One with un an unseen form. It seems you've been targeted by a troublesome company. You mean Medjet? <laughs> I've been enjoying this endless dispute over justice. However, it will soon come to an end, and though, and through the appearance of an unexpected force of all things, engaging with formidable enemies is also part of your rehabilitation. I ask that you overcome this. After all, you must hone your powers and become a magnificent thief. The thieves got famous. It's really summer now. I get sweaty just walking a little bit. I didn't think Medjed would pounce on the phantom thieves. Interesting things will keep happening this year. The influence of Jet Boy knows no bounds. I underestimated it, honestly. I wonder what the public thinks of this. Are they entertained or perhaps inconvenienced? Entertained from where I look at. Entertained, huh? A luxury for the un uninvolved. I know they mean no ill intent, so this is what the public thinks. Oops. I don't have time for conversation. My attendance has been poor due to the interviews lately. Thank you for your valuable opinion. I'll see you around. Well, if I got an A on his briefcase like here, Avenger or something. There hasn't been any news on the Phantom Thieves. Versus Medjet Showdown, which of them will come out on top? They're both just criminals pretending to be heroes, anyway. If you ask me, Medjet causes way more trouble. They attack on every company they set their sights on. I see. Well, I just hope something happens soon. But you gotta tell me, who do you think will win? Look at this shorty running again. You going to jail? You going to jail now? Hey, your phone was buzzing earlier. I got a lot of messages from an unknown account. Nice to meet you. I'm the one they call Alibaba. I want to ask you something. You're a phantom thief, aren't you? Can you really steal hearts? Who is this? Why does he know that you're a phantom thief? Is one of your teammates willing to prank on you? There's someone whose heart I would like you to steal. But I'm not asking for charity. Let's make a deal. You wish to know about Medjet, correct? I can give you information on them if the change of heart is successful. If you so desire, I can take care of them as well. You believe in my skills? I can track down their accounts just as I have with yours. But this is all I can prove at the moment. I prepared the necessary tool on my end. Look forward to it. Shouldn't you respond to it? Hmm. How should I respond? Who is this? I can't find the account to send a response to. All I can get back is an error message. Hmm. You can't reply back? I don't know what this is all about, but we probably should let everybody know about this. Bad Jed. What is happening to this company? This country? Go, go, Phantom Thieves. Go, go, Phantom Thieves. It'd be hilarious if the honor student fell off the podium. Is it over the Phantom Thieves? Hacking. I have no idea what that's like, but it sounds scary. 
I think they were getting a little cocky. They got what was coming for them. <laughs> Whatever y'all say, man. Y'all just awesome. Hating shit. Considering he mentioned stealing hearts, he knows, doesn't he? Seems so. How were we found out? He may have traced our chat log. How careless of us. How would... But how would he have known all these details with just that? Do you think that there's another cause? I'm not sure why, but that's the feeling I get. Hey, is it that easy to look at someone else's chat log? I don't know much about it myself, but it's probably not impossible, I think. How's it done? Maybe they extracted our phone's data. Why is Yuri getting an error when he tries to reply? Perhaps the receiving end doesn't exist. That's possible? Don't ask me everything I told you that I don't know much about it. Wait, might this be what is referred to as hacking? Then does that mean this guy's a hacker? I don't get high tech stuff. What does it all mean? An unknown hacker contacted us. I see. I don't really get it. Then, is this person Medjet? I doubt it, considering he says he wants to deal with them. That is, only if we take his words for face value. True. Hey, wouldn't it be great if we got this guy on our side? But, uh, but we know nothing about his identity at all. We can't trust him. I don't think it's a bad, I bad deal, though. Even if Alibaba turns out to be a criminal, I'm not helping anyone of that sort. No. Oh, right. That wouldn't be good. The I prepared the necessary tool part makes no sense either. Could this just be a prank? He knows an awful lot for it to be a prank. If he knows who we are, won't we get caught? No. If he wanted to report us, I think he would have done it already. He must have some sort of objective of his own. He did offer us a deal after all. I'm certain he'll contact us again. There's no telling when he'll do so, though. It'd be best if we stay together. If something happens, we can act as once. Yeah. So, somewhere where we can wait and hide for long hours? How about LeBlanc? Y'all gonna get me in trouble. Hey, big dog, huh? What's with the big group? Good evening. We were thinking about putting together plans for our summer. Hmm? Hmm? Is that a new face I see? Nice to meet you. My name is Makoto Nijima. I hope we're not being a bother. She's our student council president. Nijima? Nijima? Is something wrong? <laughs> nah, it's, it's nothing. A student council president, eh? I'm stunned. I hope he's not causing you too much trouble. I'm Sahiro, Sakura. But everyone just calls me boss. By the way, that was addressed to you. This old man's get going. I'll let you leave your kids be. Alright, the store's all yours. We have a late breaking news on Medjet, whose no notoriety rose since their statement the other day. Just moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. They have announced their victory over the Phantom Thieves. Medjet also warns any Japanese citizens who praise the Phantom Thieves to stop doing so, who will report any further actions by Medjet as they arrive. What? Oh, come on, it's in English. The Phantom Thieves remain silent at our question. This proves that we are just. People of Japan, wake up. You must not worship the Phantom Thieves. What? That's bullshit. Keep listening. We will discipline any who worship them. The punishment is the confiscation of possession. We are medjed. We are unseen. We eliminate evil. That's what it says. What does that all mean? They're saying that they'll target sympathizers of the Phantom Thieves. Con con 
confiscation of possessions, hmm? Perhaps bank accounts or personal information, either way, it won't be anything pleasant. Why the hell are we being singled out? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Why the hell are we being singled out? Perhaps all they care about is labeling the Phantom Thieves as crooks. That all, is, that's, that all this wouldn't have happened. That all this wouldn't have happened had the Phantom Thieves not existed. That's complete bullshit. Talk about a troublesome organization that we've been targeted by. Is there anything we can do? It's certain we can't do anything about this on our own. Hey, so what's with this letter about? We don't need any more trouble. It's rare for you to get something like this. A calling card? Anything else in there? Who is this from anyway? There's no stamp on it. Someone must have directly dropped it in the mailbox here. Could it have been Alibaba? That reminds me, he did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Don't tell me this is what he was talking about. What the hell is going on here? All we can do at this moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. Let's brace ourselves and stand by in case anything comes up. Oh dear. I've really... I've really started turning the heat up on the forum. I put a special post up and everything. The showdown between the Just Phantom Thieves and a global organization, Medjet, is here. Reaction have been great too. Everyone is really engaged. So far, most of the comments have been pro Phantom Thieves. Most likely because of what happened in Kaneshiro's case. Those on the side, other side say Medjet are hackers of justice, but there's nothing resembling justice in what they do. Someday I just want the whole site to be filled with pro thieves comments. I'm looking forward to when that a day finally arrives. He can look forward to whatever he wants, but we have no means of striking back against Medjet. We're going to be in deep trouble if we don't do something. At first, well, first the Alibaba character, and now a blank calling card. What the hell's going on? is open do you want to study and buff up your knowledge what are you gonna do study yeah i'll study <laughs> well you can answer these difficult problems you're amazing you know it you're making some good progress you can see the wisdom in your eyes behind those glasses <laughs> Let's go! Motherfuckers out here. We grind. Sateto. You'll tire yourself out if you keep at it for too long. You should stop today and get some rest. Yo, yeah, where the police? They blew off a Kichi. <laughs> Both are crossing the line. Medjet is dangerous. Criminal cat fight. Eh. They blew off a Kichi. Who? Why haven't the Phantom Thieves said anything? Having your money stolen sounds terrifying. It's unsettling not knowing what they're going to do to us. They're declaring their victory? What does that mean?
I really wish they'd stop that. <laughs> Somebody said, I can't read English. Good morning, Senpai. <sighs> Every day is so hot, I empty my water bottle so fast. By the way, summer break is coming up. Could I ask what your plans are, Senpai? Mm. What about you? Mm. I'll be doing mostly training with the gymnastics team, and if I have free time, I'll be doing self-training. Oh, I would like you to join me, Senpai, whenever you're available. It would be nice. The train's here. Let's get going, then. Hey, your phone's buzzing. Did Alibaba message you? Ryuji got Ah, it's Ryuji. Nothing. Let's know ASAP if he tries to get in touch with you, okay? Ryuji Ryuji again? He just never shuts up, does he? Music change. <laughs> Good day. Good day to you too. Eh, you responded today. Once again, I am Alibaba. You are the leader of the Phantom Thieves, correct? That's right. Hmm, I appreciate your honesty. I take it you received the calling card. So it really was from this guy. Are you at school right now? I'm in class. Hmm, you're a surprisingly diligent student. Now then, I have prepared the calling card for you. When are you going to steal it? Steal from who? What do you mean by that? Aren't you able to steal a heart as long as you have a calling card? Tell him. We need the name of the target. What's the target's name? A name? Is your heart thievery truly impossible without such information? It is. I see. Hmm, I suppose past calling cards didn't did have names on them. One moment. Very well, I'll tell you. I believe their name was Futuba Sakura. If you fail in this mission, I will expose your identity to the world and to the police. Well then, I'll be counting on you. We shall speak again after the change of heart. Is that... Hold on. Koshiro, which is the dude that I uh, stay with, and I stay in his bar, his last name is Sakura. Now I know that Sakura, Sakura is a very popular name in Japan, but I hope this person Futaba isn't related to Koshiro. Who is... Wait. Well then, I'll be counting on you. We shall speak again after the change of heart. I can't find the account to send a response to. So he threatened you and then just took off? Sakura? I feel like I heard that name before. In any case, we should let everyone know about this. Yep. They talking about our... Yo, I bet you that that person's related to Koshiro. We're gonna get reported if we don't do this. What the hell? Sakura Futaba? Futaba Sakura? Sakura What is Sakura? It's boss's last name. Does he have any family? Does he? For reals, how late back are you? Are you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living at his place. Well, the situation does make things difficult. Calling card was delivered to boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this was all related. One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which... Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. 
近くにいる誰かの仕業と考えるのが妥当じゃないかしらなるほどアリババがアリババがリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババがアリババ
All right. Thursday evening. Mm. It doesn't look like making Alibaba talk will be easy. I wonder how we're going to get the information we need. Let's watch this movie, bro. Ooh. So what are you going to do? Let's watch this movie. I'm going to smoke this joint. This heat. About ro romantic hijinks? Huh, no way he can date her if he already has a girlfriend. So we finished watching Bubbly Hills 90210, huh? Maybe you learned something about this drama. The fact that my motherfucking knowledge on encyclopedia. Yours. Yeah. Let's go return the DVD soon. We can get another book or something. Well, it's getting late. Let's head to bed soon, okay? Yo. Yo. Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but we still got all this lame shit coming up. If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. So yeah, Sakura oh, yeah. How about this Taba Sakura girl. If she's related to boss, you think people living nearby would know her? That's some keen intuition coming from you, Yuji. You should have made use on your exams. Uh, I never want to think about exams ever again. Asking around your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. Then again, I doubt it'll be that easy. It never, never is. Rocking with me today, man. Summer vacation starts tomorrow. But don't forget, there's an urgent assembly on Monday. We'll be taking attendance. There's been an unusual number of strange incidents this year. Don't do anything stupid over break. Got it? Don't go someplace shady like the red light district and don't go to the beach after dark. I want to go to the beach. I want to jump in some cold water. Seems like we won't be able to have be having fun during our summer break for a while. Mm. Yuji might be right on cue. Well, Yuji might be right. We don't have a single clue. Might as well try it. We've got nothing to lose. Let's head to yoga and gather some information around the neighborhood. Taba. Futaba, yes, I know that name. Heard it somewhere. Uh, yeah, that was the name of the team. I had a crush on back when I was in elementary school. Let's have some other people too. Sakura san's single, right? I thought he didn't have any children. Let's have some other people too. Hmm, can I help you? Do you know Futaba Sakura? Futaba? We do get the occasional youngin coming around, poking around, but I'm afraid I don't know that name. No luck here. Let's go ask some other people. 
busy as hell. Utaba? No, no, I don't know who that could be. Let's ask some other people, too. Utaba, who knows? By the way, do you eat a lot? Hey, I'm a growing boy. If it's just you and him, then you've been eating enough for two, right? You must have quite the appetite. What? You're telling me you don't actually eat that much? Maybe it's boss who eats a lot then. Let's ask some other people too. Futaba, who's that? I don't think I know anybody by that name, but... Wouldn't this Futaba get angry if they found out you're stupid on him? No. Let's ask some other people. This old man doesn't know a damn thing. Futaba, hmm, nope. Don't know anybody by that name. I come to... Sakura sons often make deliveries, but I never seen who you're talking about. So it's up until now our biggest lead seems to be the chief buys a lot of food. Far more than enough for one person living alone. Let's check out all the shops where you can buy food. That's some good detective work there, um Morgana. This place is close to LeBlanc, so we might be able to learn something here. Motherfucker say he buy a lot of food. Hey there, welcome! Huh? Futaba? Over at Sakura-san? I haven't heard of it. Sorry, come again! Hmm. I didn't find anything off Futaba. I think our only option now is to go home and ask the chief directly. He's gonna get pissed and kick us out if we keep nagging him. Mm. Mm. You read the letter, did you not? So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba? You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Wakaba. Tipped off? What are you talking about? Back to the matter at hand. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it. You're okay with that outcome. What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. Would you like to take this to domestic court? Our chances of victory are 99, roughly 99.9%. .9%. With these suspensions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. You're going that far? I told you, I don't know a darn thing about it. We're extremely serious about this one. As long as there's a possibility that <clears throat> what is that word? It, it ain't science. I guess it's science. Cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. <laughs> you fine. You win. Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. It's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will be just for a nice cup of coffee. Sexy ass older sister. And stay up. That woman is real good at pissing good people off. What's with that look? You got something to say? Custody? Doesn't involve you. I mean, me, Futaba. Where's Futaba? Is Futaba your daughter? That's enough. Just behave yourself and keep doing it. What you do, go to school, and if you don't want me to throw you out of here, you got that? Lock the store up and stop asking me about my damn daughter. Well, that basically confirms Futaba exists at least, but it sounds like she's got her own problems. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? I wonder what the chief's hiding. We can't really press him on the subject, though. He's especially after he mentioned throwing you out. He love me. He ain't gonna do that shit. <laughs> Yo, how'd it go? You find out anything about Futaba Sakura? I've been wondering about that, too. 
the hideout, okay? Whoa! So you did learn something. Fine work. I knew you we could count on you. Yuri Khan, thank you. Alright, let's meet up tomorrow. I just want y'all to know that that motherfucker, that guy. What are we gonna do? Let's play a game. Yeah, let's beat Star Fornia. It's gonna be the first game that we beat. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, let's go, Morgana. This is the final one. Let's go. We're finally on the last level. Level. The art's getting creepy. We've already beaten a lot of enemies. Be careful, the boss should be up ahead next. Whoa, enemies just poured out of the coals in the background. You've come this far, you can't afford to lose now. Yeah, on they ass bones. Let's go. All right, you managed to survive. Is this really the end, though? Ah. Huh? The screen went all black. Whoa, whoa, it's the last boss. Give this all you've got. Oh, shit. My neck. <laughs> The boss is disappearing. I think that we won. <laughs> yeah, you beat Star Fornius. You managed to survive their aggressive attacks. I bet your guts has increased. Yeah, neck hurt. <laughs> Shit. All right. Let's enjoy this ending. So this manual says if you send in the password you see after the ending, you get a prize. This is a promotion from years ago, though. There's probably no point in doing it now, but I guess it wouldn't hurt to write it down anyway. Maybe some antique game stores are into that kind of thing. Shooting card. Well, it's getting late. Let's go head home. Let's go to sleep. <laughs> Hey, yo, man, I appreciate everybody that even get a chance to hear my voice right now because trust me when I tell you, like, I love it. Appreciate y'all. Like the video, follow, you know, subscribe for me. Subscribe for your good guy. I do it for Cloud on TikTok, YouTube, Twitch. You know what I'm saying? A woman was threatening boss? Ah. Yeah, she was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. What's up? It's nothing. So, to summarize what you told us, Taba is boss's daughter and he's abusing her? I don't know him very well. Is he really that kind of person who would do that? There's no way. I bet, like, to believe so as well. I would like to believe so as well, but we don't have any conclusive evidence, don't do we? That's me banging? Is it Alibaba? I've given you a calling card and told you the target's name. You should be ready for this. Why aren't you doing it? I told you I'd help if you stole her heart. What well, seems to be the holdup? I also said I'd report your identity to police if you didn't help me. Are you okay with that? I'm serious here. What a selfish person. Well, he does have information on us. Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If so, we need keywords to get in. Try messaging him about it. Tell me her keywords. Keywords? What are you talking about? Are you just saying random stuff to dodge the issue? What are we supposed to do about this? We'd be able to figure out Alibaba's identity if we just meet with him. Try asking him if there's any way we can meet up. Let's meet somewhere. Meet with me? That would be difficult. I have reasons for not being able to go out. That's why I'm contacting you like this. He can't go out? Wait, I get it. You steal people's hearts directly. That might make things difficult. Extremely difficult. One moment. I'm thinking. Okay, it's a shame, but I'm calling this deal off. Stop looking for it for Tuba Sakura. Forget this ever happened. I won't report you to the police either. Don't worry. Wow. This motherfucker, I know who this motherfucker is. They showed her in the beginning of the, um, you know, of like this Med Jed series thing where she had said, <laughs> Med Jed, something like that, whatever. But I thought she was a part of Med Jed, but she's not a part of Med Jed. This is her. She just found out how we change people's hearts. Sorry for taking your time. Now, if you'll excuse me. What? Who are you? I said the deal's off. 
we're never going to speak again. Don't expect me to contact you anymore. We're not done here. Bitch! I can't find the account. All I get is the airman. Did he just shut down the whole operation? This doesn't make any sense. Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us leave Taba either. Hold on. Is she Fataba? Oh! What if that was her? Well, it's none of our business now. We can't contact him anymore. But what do we do about Medjet? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help with them now. Maybe they were just pranking us. They made that huge declaration, but they ain't done nothing since. I bet we got them freaked out. You mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? Yep. And now, it just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But, I guess with Alibaba and Medjet out of the picture, can we say this is case is closed? Fuck no. You do have a point. I guess it is safe for us to relax a little. Oh yeah, remember Kaneshiro's treasure? Prepare to have your mind blown. We got 150,000 yen of it. That's awesome! We really can go all out with that kind of money! Yeah, let's make up for what happened at the Fireworks Festival! We gotta go eat something fit for the fan of these worldwide debuts! Where would we go good? Oh, how about sushi? I really can go for some eel too! Sushi wa. The best method is to cook yourself on ginger before getting to eat sushi. That is my master technique. You don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it, okay? I'm all for sushi. You're okay with that, right? Sushi's fine. I love sushi. Then it's decided. All right, let's go tomorrow night. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if all that med jet business was just a prank. Now that I think about it calmly, it's strange that they haven't actually done anything. If their goal is to target a Phantom Thieves, they should want to be acting now, given our fame. Huh? When you put it that way, it kinda makes me wonder too. Especially after they taunted us theoretically like that. Yes, however, it would be best for us to come up with a countermeasure regardless. For now though, we should cautiously just enjoy sushi. This is all we can do. Yeah. But that's no fun. Hmm, you scared is right. I'm sorry for bringing this up on the day before our celebration party too. Cheer up, Makoto. We'll be eating sushi like kings tomorrow. And queens. <laughs> I hope one person in particular is on their best behavior. I refrain from saying who, though. You better not be talking about me. Hey, yo, man, y'all just really, I, it's my fault, because I should have said something's not right, bro. Fuck, I should have said something's not right. Do you think Alibaba calling card our deal, calling off our deal has anything to do with the chief? It's so hard to tell what the truth of the situation is. So what are you going to do? Bruh. Let's, uh, let's go head out. Come on, Morgana. Let's head the fuck out. Oi. It's Saturday. We have to think about tomorrow. We can go out another time. All right, let's call Oi. baby girl. Oh, my God. You want me to cut pocket? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, I can't do nothing I want to do. But you let me watch some damn TV. <laughs> <laughs> don't have nothing to play or nothing. Can we make some? Yours. All right, you can probably make like five. Good luck. All right. What's a smoke screen? Elude enemy pursued by becoming temporarily. All right, yeah, that'll work. Five of those. Five of those. Yes, sir. Five smoke screen. What are you licking, Morgana? Wow, when an efficient use of material, you ended up with even more than I had expected. One, you're definitely going to get, you're getting better. I can tell by just watching. Bruh. One. Uh, I saw that. The way that you use your hands, you did great. Proficiency? Ah, masterful. Okay, let's go to bed. Bruh, we up there, bruh. Like, we really up there, bruh. 
can't read English. Oh, oh, shit. Shit. You seem quite busy, Sei-san. I take it you're stuck in the middle of everything? The penalties made a mockery of us when they brought down Kaneshiro. And to make matters worse, Medjek, who has been dormant for some time, just declared war on them. How much more can they screw us over? Stress is bad for the skin, you know. Did you come all this way simply to be sarcastic? How about you listen to my deductions for a change of pace? You may think it's absurd, absurd, but don't you think the case you're pursuing and the actions of the Phantom Thieves overlap somehow? What are you basing this off of? The one point of co commonality across all cases is how those involved have an unforeseen change of heart. I suspected that myself, but those suspicions are unfounded. I told you at the beginning. That this was only a deduction. These just phantom thieves are rallying up the public. However, that is a disguise. The true goal is terrorist action by way of psychotic breakdown. Is that too much? There's nothing at the moment that falsifies that claim. Have you mentioned this to the police? I never tell them such things. The only value they have to me is in their mobility and organizational capabilities. Hmm. It seems you. Seems having a you having a seems having you lead lend me a hand has quite paid off. I'm glad to hear that. What about your case, Sai san? Did you learn anything from the guardian of that mental shutdown victim's daughter? Nothing at all. I see. Now, what should my next action be for our victory? Handle the phantom thieves without remorse. Use any means necessary to win. That's how I did would deal with them. <laughs> Very well. This seems to be fun for you. Are you onto something? No, not at all. Well then, to our victory. Yes. Time for sushi. This place is in Genza, right? Do we take the usual train from Shibuya? Genza. Famous for luxury shops, its property values are the highest in all Japan. The forefront of trends. Aside from the shops, cafes are plenty. If you're tired from shopping, get tea. Yes. You now have information on a new hangout spot, Ginza Sushi Bar. You can also invite people who may enjoy eating expensive sushi to hang out with you there. Man, the flounder is out of this world. That texture. I don't see any prices listed here. It's called market price. Don't worry about it. We got the cash. Oh, good. Hey, is this, the, is this the fatty tuna? Is the fatty tuna ready yet? Hold your horses and don't talk. By the way, Yuri Sakan, is boss really the kind of person who would abuse someone? That again? I can't get it off my mind, especially if it means he could be taken to court. What kind of person is he? Do you truly believe he'd do such a thing? No chance. Hmm. It's, if it's really true about the abuse, he'd be a no good jerk pretending to be a guardian. Maybe the chief is the one who needs a change of heart. Hold on a sec, about that. I actually got curious after our conversation and checked his name in the NAV. Sounds to me like there wasn't a hit. Right, anything beyond this is his family's problem. We probably shouldn't get any more involved. involved. Wait, you think Alibaba could be boss's ex-wife? He must have cheated on her and that's where Futaba came from. Doubtful. Her imagination has run rampant. How foolish. <laughs> Idiot. Still, this is delicious. I've never experienced anything quite like it before. Man, and it's all thanks to us being phantom thieves. Shut your ass up! Oh my god! Yo, Ryuji, you're a fucking idiot, bro! Uh -huh. 
<笑>ね、<笑> こんなところで。どうしたの?こんなところで。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテレビ局の。君たちはテ
Sounds bad. In other words, if we don't unmask ourselves, Medja will attack Japan, correct? It seems they are quite the attention seekers. What are we going to do about this? If only we could get in contact with Alibaba. Only our only clues are Boss and Futaba. Anyways, it's damn hot out there. Why don't we go to LeBlanc? We can talk more over there. We went through all sort of options on our way here, but it looks like we got. Looks like we got no choice but to ask for Alibaba's help. The question is, how do we get in touch with him? He cut off all contact with us after that misunderstanding. Then again, if we managed to steal Futaba's heart, he may attempt to reach out to us once more. We don't have any clues on what her key words are. Damn, Alibaba, where the hell are you? Actually, he may be closer than we think. Huh? Hypothetically speaking, if we stole Futaba's heart, how would Alibaba know that the deed has been done? Would he truly be able to discern that just from cell phone messages? You mean he'd have to meet her in person? Alibaba was able to deliver the calling card here on top of that. He can check on Futaba's, Futaba's condition. However, according to the circumstances he put forth, He's unable to meet with us. This leads me to believe that it would be bad for him if we were to see the two of them together. It seems to me Alibaba may in fact be Futaba herself. For real? So she's asking that we steal her own heart. Maybe she wants us to save her from the scars of her abuse. That would be hard to ask directly. I'd like to meet with Boss. He lives nearby, right? I know where he lives. I agree. It's real late though. What are we gonna tell boss when we get there? We'll say this take out sushi as a gift for him. But my fatty tuna! No complaining. Let's all go together. Boss may get the wrong idea if you kind and I show up alone. Wrong idea? I think that's the right idea. You know how fuck with you, baby? Nobody is answering. But the lights are on. Think she's napping? She's napping? Who's she? Even Boss would have woken up with how many times we've rung this doorbell. I think Futaba would have answered by now if she were here too. Oh, the gate is unlocked. Dude, you can't go opening other people's stuff like that. But look, the door seems to be slightly open as well. I wonder why. That's rather careless. Whoa, it sounds like it's going to rain. We should get inside. Do you think that's okay? Probably. My apologies, boss. Oh, shit. They are fucking going inside of boss crib. Hello, sir. Oh, shit. He's not out, is he? The door ahead is open. I can hear the TV. I hope he didn't pass out or something. I mean, boss is kind of old, ain't he? I'm a bit worried. Should we go in and check on him? Please excuse us. Oh, shit. Oh! A scream? What was that? How should I know? Did you hear that? Let's get out of here, please. Can we go? What are you freaking out for? I'm not, I'm not freaking out. Could it be Alibaba? I mean, Futaba? I'm getting the hell out of here. You guys are tripping. I'm sorry. Can I hold your hand? Here. Oh, shit. I can sense someone's presence. Who is it? Who's there? I can't take this anymore. I'm leaving. No. My lady will move. Ah! Oh, 
Shit! Alibaba! Alibaba, Futaba! Hey, come on, where are you? You're a hacker, right? Just show yourself. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please save me, please save me, sis. Okay. Are you okay, Futaba? Crap, he's home! <laughs> you fucking dead though! Oh! Oh! Who the hell are you? Don't move! You hear me? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sis, somebody save me! Oh my god, y'all are... Oh my god! You, what are you doing in my house? Uh, you're... Oh god, good, good evening, sir! You didn't mean to intrude... Ichima-san! Wait, are you two dating? We're, we're just, just, just friends. Friends nowadays get that close to each other. That's not it. This, um, things happened and... Your kids, your kids are here too? Um, we brought you some sushi but nobody answered when we rang the bell. The door was unlocked too. We couldn't hear the TV though, so we got worried you want to pass out or something. The door was unlocked. Yes. I do that sometimes. Guess I'm getting old. Um, excuse me. There's something we'd like to ask. You want to ask me? There's someone else living here, isn't it? Yeah. My daughter. Could she be Futaba Sakura? You told Nijima san too? Um, there, is there any way we can meet with Futaba? I think we may have frightened her earlier, so we'd like to apologize if at all. Oh, that's. Is she sick? No, it's not like that. Uh, I don't want you all getting the wrong idea. I shouldn't have kept this secret from you. Let's talk in my shop. She'll hear us if we stay here. Now, where do I start? Futaba's mother and I knew each other long before Futaba was born. My mother was a bit of a weird one, but we got along well for some reason. She was sharp-witted, somewhat stern, a little socially inept, but always carefree. She truly was a great woman. I see. When something piqued her interest, that she all she focused on, she always worked deep into the night. I thought that changed after her kid was born, but having Futaba didn't mean much. Even with that, she always took good care of her. Working and watching over a child at the same time sounds rough. I guess raising Futaba alone turned out to be tough on her in more ways than one. Alone? There wasn't a father. Do you mean... Well, there probably was one. I didn't know him, though. She never said a word about him either. She was single when she gave birth to Futaba and single when she raised her. They were an ordinary loving family. You could really tell how much she cared for Futaba. One day she left, leaving Futaba behind. She left? Yes, she committed suicide. Damn, suicide? Threw herself into the street right in front of Futaba's eyes. Damn! Something doesn't begin to describe that. That's gotta be devastating for a kid. So... Well, a lot happened after that, but I ended up taking custody of Futaba. But she was so depressed, she wouldn't even talk to me. Was that because she couldn't get over her mother's suicide? I kept talking to her, though, and she started opening up a little to me little by little. That's when I found out Futaba blames herself for her mother's death. Wait, what, why? That part she's never told me. I wanted to know what led her to believing that, but I decided not to rub salt in the wound. Then a few months ago, she started getting real scared, even when nothing was happening. She said things like, I heard voices and... Mom's looking at him. Visual and auditory hallucinations. Have you taken Futaba to a doctor? I wanted to, but she refused. Even when I had a doctor come, she locked herself away in her room. Since then, she's become what you call a shut-in. She won't take a single step outside the house or even try to see other people. 
What about you? He doesn't even let me in, come in our room. That's pretty harsh. Taba is, well, a unique girl. She's so quick-minded that conversations with her tend to jump from one topic to the next. It seems like she's always coming to conclusions in her head. There's a lot I don't get about her. Hmm. And yeah, her situation is where I couldn't let you in my house. I understand. What Futaba needs is a safe place where nobody would threaten her, somewhere she can be at ease. That's why I won't do anything she doesn't want. I don't make her do anything she's unwilling to do. Then again, I know there's no way for her to live. It's all I can do, though. What does Futaba want? I don't know. She just asks me for things that she wants, like food or complicated books. Well, that's that. Can you just leave her be? I'm going to head back then. You all better ha head home soon, too. Damn. I feel awful for prying into his personal affairs. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she's like... So she'd like to discard her feelings and pain but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjed. It's possible. Wow, this shit about to be tough, yo. Hold on a sec, do we even know if she has a power? Let's check. Sakura Sojiro Taku. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sohiro Sakura's house is going to be enough. Damn! What the? She's got one. So someone can have his house even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. Where's Morgana? I haven't seen him for some time. So ever since we went inside Boss's house, somewhere around there, he'll be fine. He's a cat The trains are going to be shutting down for the night soon, so we should probably be heading home. We should have to go to school in the morning. We have to go to school in the morning after all. Oh, right, the urgent assembly. An assembly? What about? Susan has been guarded, garnering a lot of attention ever since Medjet called in the Phantom Peace, so they need to remind us not to say arbitrary stuff online and add more fuel to the fire. We've got to meet up for every goddamn little thing. Talk about a pain in the ass. I mean, it's our fault. Anyway, let's continue. <laughs> Attack each other afterwards. It is your fault, Phantom Thieves. Jet Boy! No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she's like to discard her feelings of pain but cannot do anything about herself? Will changing her heart really help her though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up the Medjet. Hold on. I said, do we even know if she has a power? Let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sakura Satoshi Sakura's house, is that gonna be enough? What the? She's got one. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. <laughs> Morgana. Where'd Morgana go? I don't like my window open. Action train. Morgana hasn't come back yet. Morgana and I might pass each other. I should wait until tomorrow. I can't yeah, do shit without Morgana on this game. That's crazy. Alright, gang. I'm gonna stop the video right here, man. I appreciate everybody got a chance to watch the video. We're gonna get back into we're gonna jump right back into this jump, man. Don't even we're gonna jump right back into this jump, man. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna help um Man, what's his daughter's name? I don't even remember his daughter's name. But we're gonna help her out. We're gonna steal her heart. Boom. Make her good, then we're going to defeat Medjet. Not me? Straight like that. I appreciate everybody got a chance to watch the video. 
like, follow, subscribe on YouTube, Twitch, and TikTok. I love y'all, man. I'm going to get with y'all. Peace out. Protect your energy. And take your time. Peace. Yaruka. Bruh, before I exit this, man, I seen somebody that wasn't even as Get far on. as me on this game, right? And they had 350 hours. Like, what? <laughs> How? How? But anyways, man, I hope everybody enjoyed their night, man. Or if you're watching this in the day, man, enjoy your day. Peace.